Hey guys, I just figured I'd do kind of a random weekend vlog this weekend vlog. Um, today is Saturday morning and I was so excited yesterday that the weekend was here because this week has just been, uh, it was short, but um, still. Um, I have some goals to get done this weekend. I need to grade discussion boards for the class I teach. I need to set, I don't need to, but I would like to start setting up my planner for the fourth quarter because I want to get my goals in there and get set up. So I have stuff over here to do that. Sorry, this camera's so wobbly like this. Um, I also, I have a whole like little list of things that I need to get done this week. So I'd like to get some of them checked off this weekend. I want to go ahead and set up my NaNoWriMo project. I might take you for the little spin with me for that as well as starting to set up a pinterest board and playlist on youtube for my project which i did i didn't do it last year but i did two years ago and it was super helpful so i definitely want to get those things done um i really need to work on my little to-do list here i'm going to be doing an instagram giveaway um as I mentioned in the other thing, so I want to take pictures of the items I'm giving away and all that jazz. So yeah, this is a writer vlog, but also just like my weekend because I'll show you the fun stuff I'm doing this weekend too. Well, fun for me. Um, yeah, so. All right, so I'm just kind of starting out the morning with grading some of my students' discussion. Um, post and responding to emails on there. I um, I already sent some files to my editor who wanted to read some of my previous books before she dives into this one. I think I mentioned in my last video I am using a different editor for this book just because of time constraints. Um, my regular editor is usually booked months in advance so uh, I'm gonna choose somebody else this time just because I don't I don't have that time frame this time and I needed somebody with a little more flexibility because I do work two other jobs and I don't I'm, I struggle with having like a deadline I needed somebody who would be slightly flexible so anyway that's what I'm doing right now also I'm looking at my what's behind the camera because I'll give you just like a little sneak peek this is gonna be my NaNoWriMo project On a scale of one to 10, how hungry are you? 14 and a half. I doubt it. I can eat the whole cow right now. Ew. It's true. We're going to Swig and Swine, isn't it mostly pig? If I could eat the pig, all the way down a little curly tail. That's gross. <laughs> you guys end up Haven't you had, Haven't you ever had pig's feet before? No, I've never eaten pig's feet. Have you? Yes. You're gross. Kiss me with that mouth. Stop it, that's gross. Ugh. You gotta see how people eat pigs. No, uh uh. I, that's something I definitely don't want. Okay, this camera is like shaking all over whenever we hit bumps. Make sure you don't go over that crazy ass bump like yes, Mach 50. Yes, okay. Camera probably go flying out the window. <laughs> the windows are up. <laughs> well, it'll bust through. Yeah, okay. Okay. <laughs> Here's what we ended up getting. Well, I've got this pumpkin cheesecake. Yep. It's got like gold dust on the top. It's so cute. I got this, I think it's a salted caramel brownie. Yes. And it's like extremely thick. I can't believe it. And then we got these three macaroons. This one's pumpkin pie. This one's white chocolate and cranberry. Yes. And this one's chocolate pecan. I didn't record in the store, but look at this cereal I found. Come on, dude. Come on. <laughs> 
so slow because he's old. It's okay, you got it. Good boy. We have this Luna Ma. Chocolate almond espresso, I guess. He's eating a muffin. I did get a cake pop, but I don't think I'm gonna eat it right now. But isn't it cute? It's a little fox. All right, you guys. I know my desk is a mess. So it's Sunday, and we went to breakfast this morning. We could not figure out where to go. We ended up going to this place called the Roadside, which was a little diner. It was really good. Um, and then that was actually like after we waited half an hour at another place to get our order taken, like a place where you order at the counter and they were so backed up. So then we went to Marshall's, which I'm going to insert a clip after a couple things I bought that I left downstairs, but I also just, I found this there and I'm like dying. I'm dying. I'm so excited about this. It's just like a little typewriter says once upon a midnight dreary while I, while I ponder weak and weary over many a quaint and curious, curious volume of forgotten love if I could read. Anyway, it's just really cute. I love it. This was $14.99 and it's definitely going to go in here somewhere. But I think I want to put it up here um, because I just love this one. So I think it's going to be the star of this little area and if you can see me I'm probably missing. that stuff is gonna get moved down. I also I've been looking for a new purse and this is not it but while I was in the purse section um, I love this Betsy Johnson designer and this is like a tote bag it's like kind of thick feels quilted I'm not even really sure maybe it's insulated I don't know I don't even know what you would usually use this for I mean it's just a tote my laptop will probably fit in here though. But the design on it, I don't know if you can see it. If not, I'll have to try to figure out how to insert a picture or um, I'll post a picture on Instagram, I think. So you can check it out on Instagram. It's so cute. It's like spooky Halloween treats. So I got that. Um, I'm gonna insert a little clip of the other things I got there. I don't know if you guys have a Marshalls in your area but I got this adorable mug this was like $3.99 and I love the mug I love the inside it's pretty big I also found this which is adorable it's only six dollars it's really thick and I also found this which I thought was pretty cool $3.99 also found this I love this this was, I think, $5.99 or $6.99. I'm gonna put that on my desk upstairs, and then I'll show you the other stuff I got after. I'm not gonna show you what I got for lunch, but I did go to lunch because I got their Halloween stuff is in. So I went to Lush, and I'm only gonna show you this one thing because you can easily go on the website and look at it. Look at all. This is a bubble blower, so it's a bubble bar, and then you can blow bubbles after, which is kind of amusing, and. done today but if I'm being honest I have like a massive headache so we'll see how that goes anyway thanks for watching my vlog I think this is gonna be the end of the weekend vlog I didn't really do any I don't have any other plans to do anything else and you probably don't need to see me work anymore but thank you for watching if you haven't already subscribed please do subscribe 
and leave a comment below. Have a good one. The moth decided to come in on our porch and this little guy, whoa, no tiny little dude. This little tiny thing, it's like a newborn. So small, honey. Okay.